Okay, this is the second part of the little mini challenge, just the, the mindless content video here. So what I'm going to do is drive over this little hill about 20 miles per hour so I don't get airborne because I want to get airborne later. So we're going to see how far this thing will fly and then see how intact it is once it hits the ground. And that's being over revved. 100, oh, about 175. And I'm, I'm not touching anything, my hands are free. So we're gonna see what kind of damage this thing does. It's flying, and it's, oh gosh, it's going so fast. Oh! Oh, does it have a wheel? Kill the engine. What did I say? 175? I'm going to write that down before I forget. Lost my pencil. Oh, uh, so About 175 meters, feet, whatever, it's, whatever they use in this game. I just know it's 175 regardless. So you got one, two, three. Where's the other wheel at? Zoom in, maybe? Okay, yeah, it's still got three of its or four of its wheels because it's kind of like tucked up but right here so yeah the engine died so it's it's four points for that so let's go up to the top of the hill and get the next car uh it'd be cookie monster next armor motors was the winner of the very first challenge i ever had the 1953 challenge 1953 winter challenge so let's get cookie monsters car see how far this one flies and let's see how intact it is once it hits the ground. It's really flying. 300, 350, 375. 375. Oh, that hurt. Lost a wheel. So, what, 375? I'm going to try to back it up a little bit because I got wheels against the wall. That, that car's not going anywhere, it's stuck. I do know I lost one wheel, the engine's still running. I can't see the other wheel. There's the one wheel. I do not see a wheel. I didn't see it come off, but there's... Uh It might be under the vehicle somewhere, or up in the engine bay, but it's it's not intact. The engine, wow, it, he's about to lose the engine, but he's he still got his engine back there. So loss of two wheels. That's three points. Okay. Let's go for Prince of All Saiyans. This car I don't think will fly that very far. This is a pointless challenge. 
you know, they're all different vehicles and everything like that. So, you know, some's going to fly better than the others. And and but you know it's just it's just mindless content that's the purpose of this video it's mindless content Brakes fading, I wasn't even touching the brakes. <laughs> I put my controller down. 275. Everybody likes that 75 mark. Uh, engine's still running, you can hear it clearly. Got off. Four wheels, about three and a half actually, but uh, get a five out of five. Okay, let's go to the next car. Oh, let's let's uh, let's put this car home first. Cause I did that last time, and it was it's horrible. So the next one be Strop with the front wheel drive challenge. Yeah. Okay. Okay, just don't move anymore. I don't even know what the purpose of this video is. It's just mindless content. I mean, I'm not even doing this for views because I don't. I'm not a YouTube partner or anything like that. I don't get paid for any views. This one might, it might be the fastest flying car, I don't know. It's still pulling. Oh, it's gonna go nose first. Oh, 300? Yep, about 325, I'd say. And it's on its roof. It's sledding. Is this thing gonna flip it up back, back up? Nope. Is it gonna skip across the water? Say it was 325 or what? 325. It's still got off its wheels. And the engine's gone. So that's four points for a shop. Okay, let's go back to the top. We got one more car to check out. Then I'll announce the winner of this stage. Well, there's like three stages. One was Cliff, and the second part was to see how far it could fly. And and third part, how intact it is, just like the cliff, you know. And then that's three stages, and then just going to be an overall winner. And, and winning means nothing in this challenge because it's not really even a challenge; it proves nothing. It, <laughs> it's just mindless content. How many times is going to say that? So we got to look for Wall, which he's all the way down to the bottom. Yes, give me a wall. Oh, don't move around like that. Give me a wall sleeper car. Come on. Yes, there we go. It's a performance SUV. My prediction is uh, it's going to fall somewhere in the middle of all five cars. 
it's a it's a heavy SUV. Well, I don't know how heavy it is. I can't remember. But you know, I just assume that it being an SUV, it's heavy. It's a performance SUV, so it's got enough power to get off get off to a good launch there. You know, we'll see. I think it's going to finish right right smack in the middle of all all the competitors. Three twenty five, three fifty, three fifty. Oh, it's doing a nasty tumble. Oh man, that somebody's gonna lose their lunch. Oh, it's gonna land in the water. Maybe. Oh he he would have been able to keep his engine if he got stuck there. Three fifty. I was No, he, he finished like second place in that. Almost the middle. So he's kept all his wheels, so he gets four points for that. Just lost his engine only. Okay, let me write this write this down real fast. One oops. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. For the flying part, Cookie Monster won that with uh, Wall in second, Strop on third, Prince of All Saints fourth, Armor Motors fifth, the last. Okay, for how's in how on Tech DR in stage three? Uh, Prince of All Saints won that with the uh, tie for second, which is Wall, Strop, and Armor Motors. And Cookie Monster got the least amount of points in that one, so. It's, I'm going to add up all these points here. 3 plus 5, that's 8. 2 plus 12, okay, 12. 5, Okay. There's a tie for second, three-way tie. So we're going to say third place, which is last. Cookie Monster got six points. Oh no, I did I did that wrong. Hold on a second. <laughs> I saw that one there. I thought it meant one point, but that means five. So let's just switch these numbers around that way my brain doesn't mess up. Uh, so that would be four instead of two. Um. Three will naturally be three. Okay. So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, nine, ten, nine, ten, 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 Two-way tie for second, two-way tie for third. So last place, it's a tie between Prince of All Saints and Armour Motors with eight points. Second place is a tie between Cookie Monster and Strop with ten points. And Wall's the winner with twelve points. So there you go. The overall winner of this challenge is, is Wall. Not like I said, it's not. It's not a challenge. It's just mindless content for you know. Some of my friends to view, play this game, you know. So congratulations to uh, to everybody in this challenge. It's just it was fun, mindless content, just something for somebody to do, waste your time, whatever. Anyway, thank you all.